everybody. It's me. I have a tripod, so now it's a whole different... <laughs> Anyways, this is Penny. <laughs> She's going to make a video with me today, and I have all my other birds, but I'm going to show you tools. This is a screwdriver. This, this is a screwdriver as well. And this fancy thing has a light on it, which obviously makes it a little bit easier when doing work. So before I met my husband, these were the tools I used and I, I didn't have a problem with them. I, I had a socket, I have a socket set and a screwdriver set, flathead, Phillips, etc. And I didn't mind using this. This just works. It simple things, putting nails, you know, putting screws in the wall, etc., etc. And so I thought this is this is good. But when I met my husband, he said, you need to work smarter, not harder. He had power tools. So now what it used to take like two minutes, it takes two seconds. <laughs> so when it comes to dealing with parental alienation, we have to improve the tools we're using. <laughs> in order to get faster results. I'm not saying it's easy. I'm not saying it's gonna take two minutes to heal. But when someone who has experience with parental estrangement tells you to use this tool and what you can do to get better in a more, in a quicker way, in a more productive manner, you can either use this which will take twice as long, which will take two years, five years, 20 years. And sometimes this doesn't work at all because sometimes you strip out the bolt and this is no longer effective. But when you start using the proper tools, <laughs> lights up the workspace and it allows you to get your job accomplished quicker. So that's all I wanted to talk about I know it's just a really simple analogy. <laughs> Work smarter, not harder. And I will be back.